I'm now sharing with you my feelings, my thoughts, and a few remarks about the Platinum 1579 chronograph by Patek Philippe, lot 214, in our upcoming Geneva auction. This watch is pretty much unique in its position uh, within the Patek Philippe history of chronographs, uh, in terms of design, case material, and there's a lot and lot of information that make this watch intellectually and aesthetically and emotionally to me personally so interesting. First of all, 1579 wasn't just another Patek Philippe chronograph like the 130 in a classic Calatrava case. It was in fact the first time that Patek Philippe added elaborate, faceted, like briolet type shaped lugs to a chronograph. It's also the largest chronograph of the period way bigger, nearly 10% bigger than a 130 or a 533, making it quite unique in its case shape and proportions. The watch was cased in yellow gold, pink gold, in steel, but only in three examples in platinum. And let's not forget, there's no platinum 530, there's no platinum 1463. A platinum chronograph right at the end of World War II must have been out of the ordinary in every sense of the word. The three watches we know, I've had the pleasure of selling all of them, are in absolutely the world's most important private collections. All the three happen to be in Europe, none in the museum, and this one here is the last of the three ever made. Interestingly, the three watches have all different dial designs, some with a mile tachometer, some with a kilometer to cometer. And this one is even more special as the fifth of a second scale is in midnight blue. The watch does not really show it's close to 75 years of age. Yes, it has had a little bit of wear. Yes, it has a little bit of fading on the dial, but it is incredibly well preserved with strong definition to all aspects of the case. I sincerely believe that we won't see another one coming up for many, many years, knowing the other two collectors very well. And I think this is as intellectual, aesthetically important, pleasant and discreet for those who wish to wear it occasionally, as a highly collectible wristwatch in Patek Philippe's history.